showed up. Finally. It's like a dream in a box. I don't know how long I've waited, but I have waited. So let's see what the good people at B&H Photo wanted to send, or what a lot of hard work would do. Saving everything up. I got the grass cut. She isn't laying on the couch. Waiting for this to show up. Here we go. Oh, boy. Fluff. Oh man, look at that. Tiffin, good call. My little Lexar card. That's gonna be filled with awesome stories to tell. Here we've got a little step up ring. This way I didn't have to get two neutral density filters. Thank you, step up ring protect your investment everybody needs a little UV filter gotta have a UV filter and there's another one for a 50 millimeter lens gotta have it what else do they throw in here oh yeah for when your first battery wears out second battery that's the basics aha uh -huh. and look at that they even throw in something free I mean you do pay a lot of money for the camera but everyone's gonna need it a lens cleaning kit make sure you get yours also comes free. <gasps> oh, faked out. I thought it was the actual mic. Everybody needs a good dead cat for their mic, especially on a day like today where the wind is blowing. Oh my gosh. It ain't big, but it's powerful. Check it out. F 1.8 50 millimeter lens. Oh my gosh. Can I picture the word cinematic? Are me and David Finch are going to be one step closer to each other. I can only imagine. Hard part is, what am I going to film first? What's my very first picture going to be? What's my first 30 seconds of 4K video going to look like? This could be the world's cringiest camera bag. But when your camera bag's probably, gosh, I got it at 22. Yeah, 25 years old, this camera bag will do, right? I don't mind it. I'll take something that's FREE. I can dig it, which of course means we're down to the final two things in this bag. Stroke my chin. Hmm, I wonder what they could be. <sighs> there it is. There it is. The 28 to 75 F 2.8 Tamron lens. Ah, so fantastic. And of course, it just happens to fit my camera, which would be drum roll, please. Look at that. The Sony. A, seven, C, it does exist. It's like the little m and people that show up at the holidays. <sighs> I've only seen it on TV or on YouTube, but now I finally get to have it. Ah, I've got to make that first image look great. I hope the battery's charged. The battery in this thing better be charged. I think I know what I need next. A pair of scissors. Oh boy, here we go. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll start with this first. Yes. Comes with a nice lens shade, very important. And look at that, it's got the Sony caps on the back and the front. I probably wanna put my UV filter on there. Give me about 20 minutes and I'll figure out how to open this one up. There's like three ways they've sealed it. I'm gonna take off the Sony top. I'm gonna put on my UV protector. Oh boy, hermetically keep that thing hermetically sealed. Oh, look at that, look at that. Maybe the first picture will be of some of the spring flowers around my house. There's two red dots, line up the red dots. Line them up, line them up, and twist, and it locks right in. 150 millimeter lens, ready to go. Limited warranty, always good. There you go, camera strap. Aha. Uh -huh. Looks like a Sony USB charger, so we can charge the camera. Battery, let's hope there's a little charge on that. And then, in the back corner, one Sony A7C, USB-C to USB. Nice. 
Thank you, Sony. Fits right in my hand. There you go. The A7C. I love it. I love it already. Let's get the 50 mil ready. And there you go. That is small. That is lightweight. Let's look over here. Yep. You know what that needs. It needs a card. Popping it in. There we go. I got a feeling it's going to need a battery. It's got the little Sony ho green hologram. Can you see that? Sony green hologram. And one articulated viewfinder that you can turn around and close it up. That way it's not going to get scratched too much. Let's power this thing on. And so the camera comes to life. Let me bring my eye up here. Oh, it's on auto. Let's not put it on auto. We got to take it off of auto right away. Okay, I can't take it. I'm going to shut it off. I'm going to go play with the camera for a little bit. Maybe even read the manual. Woohoo! So I went to go take my very first picture with the Sony a7C. I was running around the backyard the whole time, framing up flowers, playing with a little bit, you know, figuring out some of the controls. I went to go hit the, the take the very first picture button. There was a button that says, this is the button that takes the very first picture. And the battery died, just like that. So I've had the camera 20 minutes. I haven't taken any pictures. It is inside charging as we speak. It's gonna be a while gonna have to hold off on the excitement but when I take that first picture it's gonna be a good one selfie I don't know spring flower I don't know Ooh. might have to play with the camera bag a little bit see how many pockets this thing has The very next day after unboxing it, I took my son and his friend and we went and did some mountain biking, which of course gave me the chance to put the camera at 1080 at 120 frames. Check it out. And then the last thing I did with the camera is I stuck this into 4K mode and for the first time in my life I am shooting in 4K which is absolutely fantastic. It's a gorgeous spring day here in Pittsburgh. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe in the description below. My name is Oliver Wea and welcome to 4K Sony A7C.